to uh, Spring Lake Park once again. Uh, this afternoon we are going to be determining the height of a tree and I'll be showing you two ways of doing this. One is quite accurate and one is fast. Let's do the accurate one. It's actually quite simple. Uh, you use a tool that looks like this. It's called a tangent height gauge and we can learn how to do it just by reading the directions that are right on the tool. So. It says, number one, sight top of object through sight and keep level, bubble, centered. So what you do is there are two sights that you look through and you would point those at the top of the tree. And there's a little mirror that's right below the second height uh, gauge. Use the mirror to get the bubble so it's balanced and horizontal. So I'm going to mimic that right now. I'm going to look at the top of this white birch tree. I am going to have the sights at the top, and I'm going to look at the bubble through the mirror to make sure that it's level. Now I can see by using my level that I am level, and I have the tree height in my sights. So now what do you do? Well, you look at the directions again, and it's really quite simple. It says, step two, measure the distance from you to the base of the object. That equals D. Step three, measure your height to eye level. That's H. Step four is very simple. Height of the object is D plus H. There you go. That's how you figure out the height of a tree using the tangent height gauge. Nice and accurate. That's great. All right, now let's figure out a faster way of doing it. What you do as a forester is you'd use a stick that's called a 25 inch reach built more stick. 25 inch reach because you typically hold it out 25 inches or about arm length from your body. And it's a built more stick because it was first developed at Biltmore Estate in North Carolina. So how do you use this stick? All right, you have to look on the right side. So it says on this side, quantity 16 foot logs at one chain, 66 foot distance. All right, so what's a chain? A chain is what I've laid out with a chain, 66 feet in length. I've marked it right here with a little piece of pink uh, duct tape, 66 feet long. So you might ask, why measure the tree from 66 feet in other words, one chain. Why? Where, who even came up with that? Well, it's a logging term from probably the 17 or 1800s 